Hello everybody, my name is Alan, basketball coach Alan, and I am here to show you some three-on-three -three basketball plays that will help to teach your basketball team how to run the triangle offense. I hope you enjoy. So here we are, we are on the clipboard. So here are a few three on three basketball plays that you can run with your basketball team in practice that will actually teach them how to run the triangle offense. So the, the triangle offense alone is a very hard offense for any team to learn. We can look at New, the New York Knicks as an example. They never learned it properly and as we can see it, it just fell apart. Now while when it's taught properly, Phil Jackson, for example, teaching the LA Lakers when Kobe Bryant was there. Now, he was teaching it obviously correctly, and you, you would be able to see that with his team. He won multiple championships, and so on and so forth. And I've seen lots of videos on YouTube and that about how uh, his practices went and stuff like that. So here are a few things that I picked up from there, as well as stuff I do myself that helps my basketball teams run the triangle basketball offense. So first in this three on three triangle basketball play, we're gonna have player one pass to player two, and player one will then cut towards the baseline out to this wing right there. At that time, a few different things can happen. That is the entrance into the triangle offense as we can see here, it's a triangle. So. The first one I would like to teach is player 3 back screening for player 1 once he gets out to that wing. And player 1 will then cut baseline or he could cut down the middle as well. One of those, those two options and he would be open for a layup. Once that goes through, if you want, you can have multiple lines in each of these corners right there. And then from there you'd be able to swap out each player switches lines. So let's get these lines going. And I'll put them on the on the sheet for you and we can see so let's let's put them on so we have the three lines right there we're gonna have player two run down to that free throw line extended player one is gonna go to the post player five is gonna pass the player two and he's gonna then cut to that corner next we're gonna have player one back screen for player five and he can go this way or that way for a nice easy layup once that goes through he will pass the ball back up top and we can go in a circle, so if you would like, we can have, at this time, player 1 going in the back of that line, player 5 going in the back of this line, and player 2 going in the back of that line. Now at this time, again, same idea, they're going to come down, player 4 is going to pass to player 4, 5 is going to go into the low post, and 4 is going to go and cut towards that corner. Now what we will have is... Player 4 can do a dribble handoff with player 4, and player 5 can set up a staggered screen, so now this will be a nice screen and roll. That would be one option. That would be a very good option. Let's go see another one. So we'll move these players back to uh, different lines. So now in this third one, we are going to have player three pass to player two. One is going to go to the low post. Three is going to go back over to that wing. And from there, what we can have is essentially player three running a curl staggered screen for player two red. And that would be an option as well. Let's go see one more now. We can now have player 2 blue pass the 3 red. 2 will then go down to this post. Well, wing. And then what we will have is player 3 passing back to player 2. And what we'll have now is player 1 screening for player 3 who will then cut towards the rim and may be open for a layup. Here's one more that you can do now. Player 5 will run inbounds where he's supposed to be. Get that menu out of the way. Player 5 will pass to player 5, and 5 will then go down to the low post. And 1 will pop out to the low post right there. Now what we will have is player 5 passing down to the post, and that's when two, one of two things will go, will, will happen. And I'm just going to show you both of these options right now in the same uh, drill line. Is player 5 blue could screen for player 5 red, and then he would, would be open for a shot. Or another option would be player 5 red screening for player 5 blue and he would be open for an option down there for a shot. Now, I hope you have enjoyed today's basketball videos, well, drills, anyways, plays. I don't know what you can call them because it's both of them. Anyways, I hope you have enjoyed. 
please like and subscribe because that would mean a ton to me because I make these videos every single day. And you probably hear all my emails in the background, I'm getting lots of people commenting on my stuff. If you want, you can comment below and I will probably reply. I'll see you guys next time. If you are looking for a great basketball workout, check out these Victorum bands. They are absolutely amazing. You can attach them onto a pole, you can work on your first step, or where somebody can hold you back and you can run with it and work on your legs. Check them out in the link in the description below. They're amazing.